hi friends and welcome to my channel so today I'm going to try to make mushrooms I am so excited about this I've been going out with my husband and we've been getting um, mushrooms like a side dish with much of mushrooms and so I was like oh let me just look up the nutritional value of mushrooms and they are amazing so today we got a gourmet blend hope you can see that I already took it out of the package, but I cannot, I can't pronounce these. I think it's sataki, cremini, C-R-I-M-I-N-I, -I, and oyster mushrooms and bell mushrooms. So, um, we are going, I am going to saute them with um, some, I'm going to put a little bit of garlic paste just to get that garlicky taste and butter. That's pretty much what the recipe said that you need it. Um, so I, we're gonna try it, and it, and it says just put them in there and leave it alone, and they're supposed to get brown, uh, crispy, and all of that. So this is, ooh, see that mushroom right there? This would be the C R I M I N I one, Cremini one, okay? And these just the brown ones or the sitaki. So, um, and then we have the regular. The regular just bell ones sorry i keep going out of frame but right here <laughs> so we're going to cook them up and let's see how it goes i'm so excited okay so here we are here's the pan a nice big pan i don't you can't really see me that much but that's okay you don't need to see me you need to see the mushrooms so um make sure that you fill the pan make, make sure that there's enough butter to cover the bottom of the pan um and you want to use like a medium high heat no not low you want medium high and you have to make sure that those mushrooms are extremely are dry completely dry because you don't want to get um the water you just want them to get nice and crispy um down the bottom there so we're gonna just let that go I am going to put a little bit of this garlic paste in there because I never used it before, but I'm so excited about it. If I can get it open. <laughs> so we're just letting that cook. Let me see if I can get this open. All right, I'm going to get this baby open. All right, I did it. <laughs> so I'm just going to put a look. This is, this is garlicky. I've never used this before either, but I figure what the heck, why not? So I'm just putting a little bit of, you know, in there. A little spoon. It's bubbling. This is going to be so good. I'm going to move you down a little bit so you can see what's happening there. Come on over here. And so it said let it cover the bottom of the pan. So and that's pretty much almost covered. I think it's pretty good, actually. Mix it in there. It smells good, just the garlic. The garlic smells amazing. And then you just put your mushrooms in. All right, so the mushrooms are in. And she said, literally, just cover it. Just cover it and let them cook. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to cover this baby up and let it cook. And as we're doing that, as we're letting it cook, I'm going to tell you some nutritional facts about the mushrooms that we're cooking because it's amazing what they can do for you. Don't forget to look at my other videos about the lemon water and the um, Himalayan salt flush, body flush that cleans out your system. So we're going to get some nutritional facts now Why I cover this and just let it cook. So let's talk about some benefits that we can get from mushrooms. So mushrooms have had the happy gift of making the food around them taste better while adding only very modest qualities of quantities of fat, calories, or carbohydrates. Beyond that, mushrooms are considered to have a number of health benefits. Enough through the uh, through the evidence for some claims, though the cl evidence for some claims is stronger than others. So 
We have vitamins and minerals that mushrooms contain, which um, have we have antioxidants, copper, niacin, potassium, and phosphorus phosphorus they also have vitamin c d they have iron they have b b12 b3 all all the b's <laughs> and their um a dietary fiber uh, mushrooms are a good source source of both insoluble chitin and soluble beta glucan each a form of fiber which has a role to play in human health so that's good so that's good for your blood pressure and your cholesterol so we want that we want a nice blood pressure we want nice cholesterol and something that tastes and something that actually tastes really good um, mushrooms can they they are a cancer prevention which is good white button mushrooms which we actually have in there are commonly fit that they're found in grocery stores of course you know that um, they demonstrate an ability to suppress markers of reoccurring prostate cancer in a study published in a journal Cancer in, in 2015. So that's good. The mataki mushroom long considered by agents to have healing properties. So hey, it shows an ability to suppress breast tumors in a study published in Nutrition and Cancer in 2017. That is amazing. So try to get some mushrooms into your diet. Other health benefits. Um, this is um, a paper published by the, food, the Plant and Food of Human Nutrition. And it says that the dried white powder that's in a button mushroom seems to help reduce the risk of metabolic disorder, which is implicated in many chronic health issues. So that is awesome right <laughs> um and don't forget they taste good um and they help with your immune system like i said uh let's see what else we have i just bought like just put down a lot i'm um, just like downloaded of papers and printed them out so you can at least get the idea of you know what's good so oyster mushrooms which is in there they're a type they have antioxidants in them which is um which helps you function as an um, which function as an antioxidant and lower somatic inflammation. So if you you know headaches, anything that can come with the in, um, inflammation in your body. So that's really cool too. And these stuff, th this what the what's going on? What I'm reading is actually published, you know, by in a, in medical journals and journals and stuff like that so we got iron iron which you know helps is responsible for the oxygen that goes into your blood neoxin it depends uh, that the port performs their jobs activating biochemical reactions so that's good vitamin d which is um, you know, vitamin D actually keeps you happy. So that's really, really cool. I mean, cool. <laughs> and um, so, yes, there's so many benefits of with the mushrooms. Look it up. There's so many var varieties, the benefits, everything. And I'm going to read just the health benefits just of everything. So it says mushroom thrives on organic matter, which... It, which at such as decaying wood cow manure and in the case of the highly prized truffle underground in the roots of oak trees they contain numerous protective compounds that give them the ability to absorb and safely eliminate toxins from the matter that they grow on and many of these compounds have been shown to benefit human health that is good so let's check the mushrooms now all right, so look at them. They're cooking nicely. Now it says, flip them over because we did not stir them. Remember, we want nice, crispy, crispy mushrooms. So just make sure we get them all flipped. So everything can be, you know, on the same, same level here. I almost want to put some wine in these, like a, like a cooking wine or something. But it said just add the butter. So flip them over. And. Okay. 
we're going to just add more butter. Put some more butter up in there. Ooh, I shouldn't have used that knife, but there. Recover it and let it cook. And they're looking pretty crispy. They look amazing. I want to put some peppers and onions and I oh yeah, have just so much stuff I want to put in there. But I want to just taste it like this right now. So, all right. So we wasn't supposed to actually stir them, but I just wanted to, everything to be over where it's supposed to be. Make sure that heat is like on a nice high because that's too low because I just turned it down a little bit. But you're not supposed to leave it on low. It's supposed to be like a medium high like that because we not we don't want the water. We don't we we're, we're making crispy crispy mushrooms. So cover it back up and then um we should be ready. So back at it. Here we go. I'm gonna zoom this in again. Better that you guys uh, hold on. I'm adding some thyme on there. Just sprinkle it on there. Some Himalayan sea salt because it's amazing for you. I'm just all into the healthy stuff now. Just a little bit. Grind it and some pepper. Okay, I'm gonna flip. Let it get all in there. Wow, that looks so good. The flavor. See, um, not it's it's not juicy. It's just nice, crispy mushrooms. So far, it looks good. I'm so excited. Okay. Okay, the mushrooms are done. I am so excited. Um, I'm putting this in a frame so you can actually see it so you don't see all of me right now. But, you know, we're working together. Look. Look how beautiful. <laughs> I'm so excited. And um, they cook down a lot. Pretty good. Not bad at all I say I am so excited about this that's right I had to pick you up just to let you know how excited I am and I have like all right store board because I worked all night and I just didn't have time to actually make crab cakes so we have crab cakes I made a little salad and I am gonna drizzle some oh wait hold on let me show you what else I did I made some cocktail sauce with ketchup, horseradish, and um, Worcestershire sauce. And it is amazingly good. Okay, friends, that's it. So we did the mushrooms. We got a little bit of um, nutritional guidance in it or value for what it is look it up you're gonna love them um please subscribe hit the notification bell and a big thumbs up and enjoy your mushrooms friends have a good day you are blessed bye friends hi friends um i just wanted to say i enjoyed making my um mushrooms and my dinner for my love he is going to be so happy and excited when he get home he was like good luck with your mushrooms i was like i hope so um everything came out perfect it was good i tasted it yeah so my love is going to be happy and i'm happy and you guys are all blessed